Progress Application Server for OpenEdge, or PaaS for OpenEdge, is a robust web server that is tailored specifically for OpenEdge ABL web applications. Progress Developer Studio for OpenEdge bundles a PaaS for OpenEdge development license so that you can create PaaS for OpenEdge instances and test ABL web applications on those instances. In this video, you will create a new PaaS for OpenEdge instance and then add that instance to the server's view in Developer Studio so that you can deploy and test your own ABL web applications. While a default instance is included with Developer Studio, you will want to connect to an instance that you create. Typically, your systems administrator will create the instance using OpenEdge Management or a command line utility. For this video, we will use the command line utility Passman to create a new instance. Open a ProENV command prompt as administrator and change to this directory. Type the following command where the dash P is the HTTP port, the dash uppercase P is the HTTPS port, and the dash S is the shutdown port number. Always check that these ports are available for use. The dash F option copies all deployed web applications including manager.war, oemanager.war, and oedvg.war. These files are used to manage and debug an instance. When you deploy an ABL web app from within Developer Studio, the following four tier structure is created. An instance can have one or more ABL apps. Each ABL app can have one or more web apps. Each web app has different services like REST or web. The servers view shows the structure as two nodes, a server node, and a leaf node. Server node is a combination of the instance name and ABL app name. Leaf node represents services under each ABL web app. Let's deploy an ABL web app to a specific ABL app. We'll deploy the sports app.war to ABL app. To deploy, open ProENV and type the following command. Note, ABL Apps logically separates your web apps. If you need a custom ProPath, Session Manager, and or databases for your web apps, you can create a new ABL app. Once everything is done, you need to add the server in the Servers view of Developer Studio. To do this, right-click on the Servers view and click New Server. Select Progress Application Server for OpenEdge in the Define a New Server window and click Next. In the Define a New Progress Application Server for OpenEdge window, select the new server from the Progress Application Server for OpenEdge drop-down list. In the ABL Application drop-down list, you can view the new ABL app. Click Finish and the new instance is added in the server's view. To view the instance, ABL app web app and its respective services, right-click on the server. Click Add and Remove. From the Add and Remove window, click Add All. All the available services will be added to the Sports App web app. Click Finish. And in the server's view, click the arrow beside the instance. The ABL app, the instance, the web app and all the services will be visible. Your web applications will likely require a specific ProPath and or database connections. We configure those using the database and ProPath settings in server launch configuration so that the instance will have the right settings upon starting. To change those settings, select your instance from the server's view, click Run from the main menu, and select Run Configurations. The Run Configurations window is displayed. Select your instance under the Progress Application Server for OpenEdge from the left pane. Select the Database tab and click on the Show All radio button to display all the available database connections. Select the connection which you want to associate by clicking the checkbox. Then click Apply. If your deployed application needs to access some files outside of the server's ProPath, then you need to add those entries in the server's ProPath. Click Close to go back to the Developer Studio. 
and note that once we change anything in our server's ProPath or database connections, the server must be restarted to apply those changes. Your server instance is now available in the server's view for you to deploy and test your web applications from within Developer Studio. This completes our look at adding a Pass for Open Edge instance to the server's view in Developer Studio, including customizing the ProPath and database connections for that instance.